Today on D&D Academia, our newest category, Spells. In this episode, we are exploring the spell Freedom of Movement. It is a fourth level abjuration spell. It has a casting time of one action with a duration of one hour. The range or area is a touch spell. There is no attack or save. And for the damage or effect, it has a buffing effect on the creature you touch. As for the components, there are verbal, semantic, and material. You can obviously choose whatever you'd like for the verbal or somatic parts. As for the material, the suggestion is a leather strap, which should be wrapped around an arm or similar appendage. Obviously, feel free to take some creativity and change that up for any specific aesthetic you want. For an example, if you are a necromantic-themed caster, maybe it is a length of hair instead of leather. Always be willing to be creative with spells, how they look, being casted, or even what items you use. Make sure your DM approves of everything. Now, as for the spell itself, you touch a willing creature which can include yourself. For the duration, the target's movement is unaffected by difficult terrain, and spells and other magical effects can neither reduce the target's speed nor cause the target to be paralyzed or restrained. The target can also spend five feet of movement to automatically escape from non-magical restraints such as manacles or a creature that has it grappled. In other words, being a stage magician or professional wrestler would be great with this spell. Additionally, being underwater imposes no penalties on the creature's movement or attacks. So in other words, you could move around in water as if you have a swim speed of your normal speed. You could also use this in an area where wind would normally impede your movement. Obviously, if the wind is strong enough to lift you off your feet, it will still do so. But if it is pushing against you, you should be able to walk through without any issue. So, this has been a discussion on the spell Freedom of Movement. Enjoy using this spell going forward.